So hi everyone, welcome to you all in my another video. And this video again is about Kuwait. So this is my second video. In my first video, I just recorded about you know the uh, what is the the, uh, the requirement for pharmacist, pharmacist salary, how you can apply, and the current scenario. But in this video, I'm going to discuss about you know there is one advertisement, and based on that advertisement, you can see that you know what are the requirement they are asking is, is is there anything else and what are the salary so what i discussed in my previous video you can compare here on what i'm i said in my uh, in my previous video it is correct you know uh, so we can see here so uh, this is one job this is the urgent requirement uh, of pharmacists for under moh hospital in kuwait so this is basically a ministry of health hospital this is the government hospital in kuwait they are looking a pharmacist right now um, so you can apply basically and there is no need to write any exams you know so what are the requirement the salary each and everything uh, i'm going to discuss here so you know the reputed under moh company in kuwait is seeking social pharmacists for their under moh hospital in kuwait urgently um, um name of job pharmacist and qualification they are asking diploma or or, or degree so if you are diploma in pharmacy or you are bachelor of pharmacy or either you are a farm d so or you are m from whatever uh, your degree you have and they are asking minimum two year experience working as a pharmacist in hospital or community pharmacy uh, minimum two year and more than that if you are three four year it is good and they are male and female and age limit is uh, 24 to 40 years, so up to under 40 years only they are asking. And salary, they are giving that, that, that you know, 300 to 350. As I told you in my earlier video that this is like a initial uh, salaries, but after one year, you will be registered pharmacist, then it, it, it goes to the uh, increasing, you know, day by day. So this is like initial salary. You are in your country, you are in India or Pakistan, so you can apply this job. And once you land there, it will be increased. Uh, even I can say this is not very uh, bad. And because they are given that the facility free food, they are given free accommodation, they are given a uh, free travel, they are given and holidays, other benefits. So everything they are given is, and you, you, you can, whatever they are paying, you can just save, you know. So there is no need to spend. If you are getting like 350 per month, so at least 300 you can save, you know, so there is no even uh, more than that you, you can save, you know. So I can say that you can save like 75,000 to 8,000 you can save per month, uh, especially if you are a single, this is a very good opportunity for you. So mostly, you know, this kind of job, uh, 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 the, the, this is based on uh, some agent. So agent normally they charge money from a candidate, some, uh, some agent and some agent they charge from a hospital so you know so uh very carefully you have to decide because many of might be a fake because I, I i'm just explaining so i'm just sharing with you you know i'm not saying just go and uh, blindly and pay your money you know so whenever you are it's just a money involvement you decide a person you look is like genuine and if you trust then just uh, give the money you know so they are asking their cv biodata in ms format and uh, your uh, certificate SSLT, then high school diploma degree certificate, and your registration experience certificate, your passport scan copies are asking, and uh, and uh, photo. These are all requirement I already discussed in my previous video. The same thing, transcript. They are asking additionally Aadhaar card because if you are from India, so Aadhaar card mandatory as can you? Or you have. Uh, their experience. They are looking at least three to five years of experience. So it's very demanding. And the salary is saying, they are 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 there is no need to write any exam. There is an exam, Ministry of Health connected exam. That's mostly in government hospitals. You know, so once you landed there, you know, then uh, their employer uh, may ask you to go there. But if you are uh, uh, looking a job in a private sector, working as a as a pharmacist in community pharmacy or private hospitals, there is no need. 
directly they are having even in this job advertisement treatment also they are not asking to write an exam you just have experience or you have just diploma or degree or you just you know, can apply for the job so this kind of job very good basically if you are you know if you are from a mediocre family so you can go there and work two to three years and then you can ship to australia us canada you know uh, those kind of uh, country because when you are migrating you need at least five to ten lakh in, in your account uh, when you are uh, moved to ऑस्ट्रेलिया और कनाडा यू नो सो ये बहुत ही अच्छा मैं समझता हूँ एट द एंड के आप लोगों के पास जो है इसमें कुछ भी नहीं मांग रहा कोई एग्जाम नहीं है डिप्लोमा डिग्री हो दो सौ तीन साल का एक्सपीरियंस हो तो आप लोग वहाँ चले जाइए दो सौ तीन साल काम कीजिए पैसे सेव कीजिए और उसके बाद फिर अपना आगे का रास्ता देखिए कि आपको कनाडा जाना है यूएस जाना है ऑस्ट्रेलिया आना है तो मैं हूँ यहाँ पर है ना तो और यहाँ के एक बज गया दोस्तों मैं अपनी वीडियो रिकॉर्ड कर रहा हूँ प्लीज मेरे वीडियोज को लाइक कीजिए शेयर कीजिए और मेरी बात ज्यादा से ज्यादा लोगों तक पहुँचाइए ताकि मैं और वीडियोज बनाता रहूँ एंड थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो